Hello, I'm Joe Rimmelspach at Ohio State University, and it's Monday, April 21, and we've had a whole plethora of calls, emails, and questions about poor quality turf in the state. Uh, many people are enjoying the beautiful weather this Easter weekend, and we're out in the lawns, and they reported two general symptom patterns. One is distinct brown patches, something like we have right down here, and then other cases, more of just a thinning or a lot of tip dieback and browning throughout the lawn. What's going on, as I want to explain, this started about, uh, the setup for this was about two weeks ago. Um, we started having some warming trends, turf started growing, people were out mowing the lawns, and uh, they were, of course, very lush coming out of uh, the springtime conditions. And then, uh, last Tuesday, the 15th of April, we had a very cold snap. Much of the state had snow. In central Ohio, temperatures went down into the maybe mid-20s. Northern Ohio, I know up by the lake, they, had, they were in the mid or lower, even teens. Record low temperature, cold temperatures. And what happened is this lush grass, especially if it was recently mowed, was very tender and with these severe cold temperatures there's lots of tip dieback. So if you look at individual leaf blades, the end of the leaf, maybe just the tip, even maybe half the leaf, maybe even all the way down to the base shows this browning from cold damage. Um, some of the patches oftentimes reflect a, a different type of grass, maybe a clump of tall fescue or some type of grass that was a little taller and mowed a little shorter and these were very lush and sensitive and, and damaged by this cold temperature. In some cases, the whole lawn may have kind of just a brown appearance. If you look carefully at the tips, you see a lot of brown tip dieback. Um, this was all temporary, even though it looks radical. I know one homeowner called us, and they were even concerned that maybe someone spot treated their lawn with Roundup because they were very distinct brown patches. But these will all recover. Just go to the base, as long as the base is alive, New leaf tissue will develop. It may take quite a number of mowings and good growing conditions for the leaves to grow back up and have them cut and the new green tissue to appear, but the lawn should recover quite well. So if you have any questions, continue to you know, give us calls or email us and we'll be happy to work with you any way possible.